Let's see if we can figure this problem out. So we have this lever, and a force of 100 newtons is applied to the lever at a 30 degree angle. This force is applied 2 meters from this knob, which is the axis of rotation. We're trying to calculate torque on this system. Now if you didn't catch my last physics video, here's the equation for torque. I want you to try solving this problem on your own, and from the four options listed below, A, B, C, or D, try commenting down below which one you think is correct. Alright, so here's how you can solve this problem. So we're using this equation for torque, where torque is equal to force times displacement from the lever arm times the sine of the angle between the displacement and force vectors. Now the applied force is 100 newtons. Distance from the lever arm is 2 meters. Then we multiply this whole thing by the sine of the angle between the vectors, which is 30. Now the sine of 30 is equal to 1 half. And this 1 half and this 2 are going to cancel each other, so we'll only be left with 100. So the magnitude of our torque is going to be 100 newton meters, and if we assume counterclockwise to be positive, 100 newton meters is going to be the solution to the problem. So if you answered with option D, you would be correct.